Hi, I'm Ashley. And I'm Jada. And you may have noticed, no Saturday video, but that is because we are doing a special one, one year, year anniversary. anniversary. Um, that's right, it has been exactly one year from today. Since we shot our first video. A year ago today, September, September. A year ago today, August the 9th is when we shot our first YouTube video. Um, what kind of started the journey was um, back at the end of January, beginning of February, I had went to Los Angeles and Jada had moved to Florida. As I, you guys know. I had spent a month in Los Angeles and I did a bunch of different things. Um, some YouTube, I went to some shows and different stuff. And so it kind of got me interested about like doing a YouTube channel. And then I met Michael on Hook, Line, and Chill and I started to do stuff with that. Once I got back from Los Angeles, I started coming to Florida pretty often to visit Jada. And I, you know, every now and again, and she misses me. Yes. And it's I was like, wait. it was our first time like living apart. Yeah. Girl. And so after a couple of recordings of Michael and I was going down to Florida, I was like, Jada, let's start our own YouTube channel together. Like, it'll just be a fun thing for us to do even if it doesn't take off and we can look at these videos for a long while back. And so, thus the beginning started. A year later, we have a little over 7,000 subscribers. Thank you guys. If you haven't subscribed, do it. And we have 416,368 views. Yes. As we're recording this video. So, really I should say, we have over 416,000 views mm -hmm. on the channel and 84 videos. This will be number 85. Yes, it will. And our most watched video has been our twins water balloon fight video. And um, 70,000 views. Yes. And so one of the things that we're going to talk about this episode is we're going to show you some behind the scenes that you may have not seen, like a few little clips or extras, but we're also going to like talk about the inspiration for a couple videos and some stories behind it. Mm -hmm. And so, since the water balloon video has been our biggest video, I will start with that one. A it's lot. A year in, a year recap. Recapping yeah. the year. Recapping a year. And so, um, a lot of you guys will ask us like how we came up with this or people will say a little something and we'll be like hmm and we'll take like an idea from that and stuff well this was um it was gonna be like a truth or dare video <laughs> yeah. and what i was gonna do is i was gonna laminate little pieces of paper with like um like some dares and some truths and stuff like that and what it was gonna be is that we were gonna throw them at each other and when they broke uh, whichever one broke you know we're gonna take turns and then whatever the paper said is what we were gonna do. Mm -hmm. And um, and then Ashley was like, uh, well, Jada was working a lot at that time, and so, I'm working more now. Yeah, but she failed to do the the, the truth dare laminating part. Yeah, and so we were just like, we got these water balloons now. And when she had picked up, I think at like a second hand shop, she had seen no, them. No, it was like the Dollar like, Tree. The Dollar Tree. And she's like, I think we could do something with these. Yeah, that's, how, both... that's how it started was, yeah. was I, I had come up with that idea and I was just going to put a piece of paper in it and we were just going to have a balloon and we were going to pop it. Like I have to like sit on it and pop it and whoever sat on it and popped it would have to do it. And then we were like, that'll be too loud on the camera and maybe not like as much fun to kind of yeah. watch. And so that's how it like snowballed. Yes. Into this. That's how a lot of, they'll start with like a kernel of an idea and we will like. Yes. Which. In both. I think we should go back to the original one where we like yeah. do the water balloon and I throw it and like we'll have a bunch of different questions and stuff. So in the links down below, if that, or links, in the comments down below, if that is something that you're interested in seeing, let us know. Add truths and add dares as well. If you're like, yes, you should do that. Then you need to tell us what a good dare would be, what a good truth, and it needs to be something like it can't be a dare where we have to like you know. Yeah, it needs to be something that we can do there. Yeah, kind of pretty yeah. easily. And so, um, I yeah. mean, if it's like if it's a something we need to bring, it. like the idea there, like a, a whipped cream pie to the face or something like that. That's just off the top of my head. Like that's something we can bring with us because we know that dare exists. <sighs> <laughs> She's already like, I don't, I don't know, want to like, put that, Why do you put that out there? <laughs> yeah. Like, um, 
Maybe a couple of you guys were like, you should throw raw eggs in each other's hair instead for the video that we had a couple videos ago where Ashley threw eggs at me. Y'all were like, throw them in each other's heads. But I will tell you guys, I had a bruise. Okay, yeah. so that is the idea for this that video. Yes. Now I want to tell you guys a story about our very first video, yes. which was our British Treats video. Um, Ashley was coming in kind of late. It was like, I don't know, 6.30, 7 o'clock, and I was picking her up. It was the first time she'd picked me up solo. Yes. And, um, and I was wearing my outfit already. And so, like, I had my dress on and my hair and my makeup done because I was picking her up, swooping her, and we were just, like, going straight at it. Because we had a video. I had a video on Hook, Line, and Chill that was going to come out the next day, and I mentioned that we were going to be doing our own YouTube channel. So we had to get this video shot, recorded, edited, all in one all evening. And so when I went to get her, I realized that the gas in the car, I had like half a, like I was like at one mile and I was like, what? <laughs> I was out of gas really close to the airport. I was one mile from the airport and I'm trying to type in my GPS. Like I pull over to the side of the road. I'm typing my GPS where the closest gas station is. And basically I would have to like really go out pretty far. I don't know, five, 10 miles or whatever, and then come back. And I was just like, I might as well just pull into the parking lot <laughs> and get Ashley into the parking lot. <laughs> However, she did not pull into the correct parking lot because she was not familiar with the airport. No, I pulled into the right parking lot. I was trying to get Ashley to take a shuttle, a train shuttle, and she couldn't that find it. It did not go! It, just, it did it not did go! Exist. It did not go. But where the train shuttle was, I walked over there to, to get someone who could tell Ashley, like, how to get to it. But instead, she found a good Samaritan. I did! I found someone who works at the airport who happened to have, like, a five-gallon of gas thing in his back of his truck or yes. whatever. So not only did he give us gas, but first... Because Jada and I clearly did not know the airport heads or tails enough to explain to each other where one was at versus the other, even though I told her I am at the arrivals. What level is that? Just follow the arrival sign. But she was already so like frantic from being late, going was, to the wrong place, running walk. out of gas. Yes, but so. I had to walk to where this other like shuttle place was. And, um, and so he was like, I'll just drive you back. And his truck was very clearly, like, you know, marked. He had ID and everything. Yeah, so, because we hadn't gotten into other people's vehicles. Yeah, okay. But it mm -hmm. was pretty safe. Yeah. And, um, but he was like, I'll just go pick her up and then we'll go back to your vehicle. And at this point, um, he's not told me that he's got gas in his vehicle. It's just when we pull up, he gets out and gets it. And I was like, holy cow! I was like, that's amazing! It wasn't, he was like, it's not full. He's like, it's probably got about two gallons in here. But he like, took all of it and poured it in, and I was just like, And then he wouldn't nice. take money for the gas either. No, I wouldn't. I would try to give him cash. He's like, no, no, it's fine. And um, I'm telling you, my story inspired. There's now a gas station right next to where that parking lot is. <laughs> I'm telling you. They were like, we could make some money doing this. Um, but it was very, like, it was it was a bit hectic and stressful. But um, we've just been so lucky that, like, people... Yeah. There have been people who have not been nice and everything like that, but um, we've we found very kind people in a lot of situations who were able so to help we them. shot the video and then we edited it, but we had we never edit edited a video before, and so we did a lot of cut fades for our first couple of videos instead of no, just no no cut. no don't take this away from Christian. Christian edited our first video for like three hours. Because he watched just try to do it, or two and a half hours maybe. <laughs> he watched just try to do it, and we were failing miserably. He had used this like program before when he and I shot a tourism video. Yeah. And so he was familiar with like where things were and stuff like that. And we were just we were going very slow and it was getting really late. And he was just like, guys, I'll, I'll I'll edit this for you. But we did a lot of cut fades until then. Yeah. <laughs> and then I so did a lot of cut fades later and stuff. Not so much now. Jed every once in a while still gets a little happy on the rare video that she has. A lot of cut fades. Um. Okay, so the next video that I thought... Hair video, which Jada had already prepped before we ever recorded our first video. Because she had went to, um, if you guys can remember, if you haven't checked out the video, we'll put like right here in the... 
in the little thing to click and in the description below for like the videos that we're talking about but they had did a color she was not very fond of so no, no, i was happy with the color but my roots were growing out and you can have dark roots and that's okay but you can't have lighter roots so jada was gonna bleach and redo it and so we thought i thought jada cut her part of the video together and then i was gonna do a reaction to it reaction video yeah i was gonna do reaction video which to was it. for one of our first videos was very ambitious People who do reaction videos all the time are like, no, it's not. But for us, yeah, we still, still. We've had people in the comments say, like, can you react to blah, 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 or blah, blah, blah. But we still don't know how to do reaction videos where, like, you can record it and pause it. and play. Yes. And it's so work here well. is some of the footage that we did. I sectioned my hair off. We've got our mixture. Go. Did, did she, she just say she sectioned, she sectioned her, her hair off? Because that, that did not look like, like sectioning, sectioning to me. me. And it just as you could see, yeah, the sinking was all wrong for it and stuff, and so we scrapped that. Decided to take what Jada had already cut and have me fixing her mistake. And fixing my mistake, she failed epically. She just basically put conditioner in my hair for an hour and washed it out, and there was nothing that changed. And we thought about just taking all of that first one out and not even having that in there, but we're like, ah. We, we recorded a lot of footage for yeah. it, so we're gonna do it. But there was a time that we re-recorded a video after we had pretty much shot most of it. And that was when Most of it we shot all of it. Did we shoot all of it? We might have. Yeah. It was um it was when Ashley I did the blindfold and I did Ashley's makeup because after we went we don't always get to do this, um, but we'll try and watch the videos, like a little bit of them afterwards, just to make sure that like the sound was okay or you know that the stuff and there are some things like you know we're out in the out in the country and here a few half a mile or so away a neighbor's mowing the lawn but um a neighbor's always mowing the lawn <laughs> <laughs> but the problem was was that my old busted up phone we were using as a secondary camera and it ended up somehow being the primary camera the way that we shifted <laughs> But the and quality of the video was not very good on it. We were just going to use it for periodic side shots. But somehow, the good camera ended up getting side shots and got all twisted around. Ended up being like, yeah, didn't work out. And then when we tried to cut it together, the, the contrast between the quality of video was just too different. Too apparent. Yes. And so we had to reshoot that video. Um, but you know what? It didn't help my skills at all, no. really. Like, and we did change it up by having her do it from behind, yeah. whereas the first time uh, we did it like Next facing each, each other. other. Yeah, we were facing each other. Yeah. And so I was like a little monkey on her back for the second time. But I will show you what the end result of the first one looked like. Very similar. Like, I seriously, I did so bad. Um. And then one video, the Halloween video, where we make t-shirts for each other. We didn't make t-shirts for each other. We oh, yeah. made t-shirts. Yes. And, and then, then we, we went, went to, to the, the public and we got them to vote on which t-shirt they like the best. Which well, I still think that mine was the best, but we had a bunch of adults there. And there were kids too. We didn't ask a bunch of kids though because we didn't want them all on the video and get like suppressed and stuff like that. Well, I still think mine was the best. <laughs> well, um, we had said at the end that we cut it quickly, quicker because of copyrighted music. And while there was copyrighted music playing, so we'd already thought, oh, uh, we'll, we'll just have to do a voiceover for it or something like that and quiet the music down. Well, sorry guys, a bug flew in my eye. That wasn't 100% the truth because what it ended up happening, it was like, it was like busted phone. <laughs> It was like it already knew that it couldn't record that music and didn't record audio. It was so crazy. It was like almost at the perfect time. The program we were using at the time, it had corrupted the file yeah. of the video file. At that point. So, so the program use wouldn't use the rest of the video. And so we couldn't do the voiceover part that we wanted to anyways over the music. Yeah. Because when we watched it, you know, on the phone, on playback, you could see the video and just see that there was no music. But then you couldn't even use the rest of it. So we're like yeah. darn improvised there, I guess. Yeah. I'll tell you, my favorite video that I feel like is underrated <laughs> is the Etsy video where I pranked Ashley. We're like, 
Oh my gosh, you I don't think enough people so watched many it. Down. I know. Guys, click the link, okay? It was my favorite because like I felt like like you know, I got all crafty and everything was pretty. This stuff is still decorating my house, okay? And um, <laughs> Yes it is. And uh I thought it, I just thought Ashley, you know, she had no idea. And she even said stuff, you know, about it and so I could tell you the hardest video. To edit or to shoot? To edit. Okay. <clears throat> I don't know. Some of you may know, but our Thanksgiving video, um, I had a breakdown. Oh. I had spent eight and a half hours editing this video because there was like four hours of footage almost to, to cut through. Um, different angles, different, I mean, it was just all different stuff. So it was like eight and a half hours. As I was going to render the video, it deleted all the stuff I had edited. And I could not get it back. I still had, obviously I still had the video files because I ended up doing a Thanksgiving video. But the eight and a half hours I had just spent, like I didn't even sleep. Okay, because I wanted it to go out 8 o'clock. I said it's a 5.30 in the morning editing this video, okay? And then it was gone. I called Jada. She was at work. I was trying to keep it together. I was like, I think I accidentally, and it was my fault. I, I hit something wrong. And I was like, and the video was gone. I was like, did you push the... But undo I just button. Yeah, <laughs> said, like, "Can you just undo?" And I was like, <laughs> "I've tried. I even tried to do like a recovery thing, all of this stuff." And I was like, yeah. "I took a shower. I cried in the shower." Jetta came home during her lunch, her lunch break, um, because even though I'd finished at five thirty, it was supposed to have rendered while I was asleep. And it didn't. So when I got up at at eight, to anyways, doesn't matter. The point is, it was gone. So she comes, she consults me, and then I get back on the wagon. And then I thought, because I spent eight and a half hours editing the first video, that I was just gonna throw this together. Thanksgiving was the next day. I wasn't gonna spend a lot of time on this. I'd take a couple of hours and be done with it. No, instead I didn't. I still spent. <laughs> Almost eight hours editing it the second time. No, it wasn't that long. No, it was six. It was six. It was like six. No, no, no. By the time I got home, no, I wasn't. No, remember because it didn't get uploaded until that evening because we were flying home for Thanksgiving, mm, maybe. And it was going okay, but it didn't take us long the second time because I did know where I wanted to cut stuff already. But I actually added a couple of things to that video that I hadn't even added. It added it <laughs> that I hadn't even added in the first video like the number counting for my uh my eating off the spoon and stuff like oh, that yeah, was just that really was, cute yeah. that wasn't in the first video and stuff and so I was really happy with it I was happy to be done with it and I was super cautious <laughs> but I think um overall it's been a lot of fun we've had a few like hit snags and stuff our patreons have seen a couple of videos that have like we've we've not done because something happened and we were able to like yeah. complete them for whatever reason and they've seen like stuff that like our exercise video that we did we did we tried to shoot that and mm -hmm. then we didn't get to actually do it until like months later and so they yeah. saw like the first scrap video and and mm -hmm. we've got a magnet fishing video that um scrapped <laughs> scrapped or open mm -hmm. and um and so i don't know but i, say, I would fun. say probably like the river vlog might have Which, actually been the fun just because like we got to do stuff that we wanted yeah, to do <laughs> such a fun day like yeah and we didn't you know it's like we planned like what we because we had been before mm -hmm. and so we knew like kind of the things that we wanted to show so we kind of storyboarded what we were gonna do yeah um but it was stuff that and we that video do took anyways. me a while to edit as well because there was a couple of hours I do of edit footage videos. she's talking about all of our i do edit some of them you know some of them so I was really happy the the video did so well because it did take a long time to edit and there was a lot of footage to go through and stuff like that. So I was really happy. I was really pleased about that. So we just want to thank, you know, the first person that joined, which would have been our family. <laughs> I was going to say, which would actually be my personal account. 
And um, <laughs> for the last person that's joined, and for all of you guys who are going to go ahead and subscribe today, because you're like, why haven't I done that and already? all the people in between. You guys have been so great, and thank you for following us and watching and just being so supportive on all your comments. We appreciate it. Yeah. Thanks, guys. We couldn't do it without you. Otherwise, we'd just be making videos to show ourselves later. Otherwise, we spend a lot of time and money and effort <laughs> for our videos that we'll just see. That's true. But, hope you guys enjoyed this, like, year recap, how I got started, stuff you've not seen before, stuff you didn't know that happened, and things like that, and, uh, just enjoyed. We'll see you guys later. Bye! Ashley and Jada are twins.